Now we've created our virtual world, we need to add some text in order to be able to display our learning. So using my keys, I'm going to rotate round and I'm going to put my central idea up here, somewhere that it's clearly visible for anybody who visits my virtual world. So if I click on library and under building blocks just here, I've got some text that I can pull out. And if I double click on the text, I can edit it. So I would write my central idea here and I can adjust the size of the text. I can also change the color. And a really useful thing is being able to attach objects to other objects. So if I double click and if I go to attach, there are all these blue dots around in the code space and it means that when I click on them, this object will be attached to this object, just like that. And it still means that I can move things around, I can resize things, and I can choose where to have it on that object, but it means that I don't have to fiddle around with placing it on exactly the same plane. So if I use my keys to rotate round slightly and scroll in, I could do the same, but this time with my lines of inquiry. So here I'd have my three lines of inquiry that I'd put up on my display board. Change the color so there's some contrast, they stand out easily. Click on attach. Oops. There we go. And adjust the size accordingly. So an option is attaching text to objects that already exist. Another option is pulling out a, you could call it a virtual display board. And if I deselect, so by clicking elsewhere and then double click on the text, I can edit here and I could put an interesting fact on here and I can move the text around if I click on the text or if I click on the edges, then I can move the text and the board at the same time. And again, you've got all the same options as before. I can change the color if I want it to stand out and I can also attach it to other objects. So I could, if I want to frame things, click attach and I could put that up here. I'd have to rotate it once it's been put on there though. And that's the back and that's upside down. So I'd have to rotate it this way and then that way but that will be attached to that wall. So there's another option. You could either put text onto an object or if you wanna pull out a virtual display board and you can display information that way.